Hey, hey, ready, Beardo Dude, back with another episode in our City of Gold playthrough. And today we are going to take on the Bastion Dungeon out of Manshire and take on the most impossible boss I've ever faced. So stay tuned. <laughs> Before we get started, click the like button and subscribe. Links to support the channel are in the description. Join our Discord server if you have any questions or would like to view archive videos. Also, follow me on Twitch and throw a Prime sub my way. Now on to the video. Alright everybody, we are going to continue our playthrough here. We are going to take on the Bastion Dungeon out of Manshire. So I got rid of, uh, I basically since, uh, well, I didn't do much. You guys saw everything that I had done. Um, so I, I repaired these. We've got this ring. Otherwise, it, not too much change. Um, they haven't restocked, so there's not really anything too fantastic over here. Um, in Manshire. I still like my split van braces better than... Like these, because they add to Fumble Chance. Like if these weren't plus to Fumble Chance, I'd consider. But since these are negative, and they got pretty decent protection. These are pretty much end game. I think the only things maybe is like the belt and the shoes could probably get upgraded. But even the this right here is probably as far as I want to go. It looks like they did change the... The coat. I don't think it used to have minus 3% dodge, but they might have tweaked it. We are in version 21. So there's, at the time of recording, there's only information going up to 17. So I'm not sure what happened in those four patches. What got added or changed. Only time will tell. So, knowing all that, I think everything is good to go yep so we will we already got the quest pretty straightforward it's actually a complete straight shot so we'll see if we get any randos finding us uh we will fill up our water get a few sups there and then i think we're good to go the Bastion Dungeon typically has, like, a, a kitchen area, at least on one of the floors, so. It shouldn't be anything too crazy. Oh, hi, guys. Probably try to lure them to get a... There we go. No, still missed it. We're pretty ridiculously strong at this point, so... These ambushes aren't really going to do much to us. If you're wondering how I'm moving so fast in the game, I'm playing the game at two and a half times speed. If you're wondering how I'm doing that, there is a link for a game trainer that I'm using in the description. Alrighty. Well, I don't know how much we'll encounter. For some reason, it looks like I even went this way. Gotta get there before it gets to be dark. Yeah, it looks like I killed... I must have... Maybe we did clear this dungeon already. We'll see. If there's equipment over there, then I probably have done this one already. I do think that the difficulty has increased, though. So we'll test that out and how that's supposed to function. Oh, this guy wants to fight. Is that too bad? Don't be using my moves, man. Let's see if we can get a few of our cooldowns a little less at least. Jeez. Oh, he dropped an apple. Don't mind if I do. Let's see if our, our morale and sanity is still pretty low. Someone had mentioned in my comments that it's probably because I had the cursed item. So I'm kind of hoping <laughs> that's going to go away now that we ditched it. I probably need to just like... Oh, I guess I could have just ate that mind wart. 
That's what I was looking at. I was like, let me check my morale and sanity. It's always good to be grabbing berries. Oh, man. I hate, like, getting caught out in the dark like this. I wish something different would happen. Like, that would be a pretty cool update. If, like, something would happen different in nighttime. Or, like, how on, like, Terraria's, like, there's a blood moon. It's, like, you could have, like, one night of the month or something where all the proselytes come out to, like, kill people and stuff. Okay, so that, these are, okay, these, this does look a little bit upgraded. So that's a turncoat. He's got the two-handed hammer. It's not bad. So we'll draw him out. See what we can do about this. Let's see, because you want to set it up where we're going to go right there. So let's do, and then we'll go here. Boom. Boom, baby. Ooh, man. That'll do it. All right. Reinforced war club. Uh, what do they call these guys? Are they just the cutthroat? Okay. So it's just a, these two guys here. I'm gonna flip it around on you. He has a Dirk. It's pretty bad. I thought the Dirk wasn't bad. I think I get the Dirk and the Rondell mixed up. Actually, a little bit of money, so it's actually not even a bad idea to toss it. I mean, uh, to keep it for right now. Yeah, the war club, that war club's pretty messed up. All right, I don't, yeah, we don't have nothing to cook. So, let's get to it. Alright, treasure chest, first room. Always like that. Make sure you're examining your surroundings. We do have our handy dandy crowbar. Oh, we got... Yeah, see, we're a little bit higher level because these Kirk guys... With their deadly trick... They can get you in a bad way. All right, I don't know. I'm going to assume that he would go. See, I could have waited there to see if I could have gotten him in that corner, but we'll just we'll do the easy peasy way. We'll just attack him through this door. All right, somebody hurt us. We did get a level, though. So that's exciting. We got that going for us. All right, so we're still three away. We probably we'll go with uh we'll go to fifteen. So now we've got a bonus for uh one of the bonuses for strength and one bonus for agility, at the very least. We'll probably throw the last one maybe into into um strength. Maybe maybe we'll do agility. Counter chance and fumble chance is probably going to be more useful if we're only getting that one point. I think we will just go with respite. Uh, we are using more energy now that we are using. So these two actually do kind of complement each other. So we'll keep on with the mace tree. We're going to go mace heavy on this one. And this this bozo over here looks curious. So, Oh yeah, he's curious. Nice. Oh man, yeah, see we're getting we're getting a little bit serious here. We got a mage. Alright, what do we get? Okay, we're gonna get our stuff back before he gets here. He missed. That was weird. Maybe they can do that. <laughs> Alright. Let's check loot. That's what's really important. If this is more difficult, then it better have better loot. Yeah, it's acceptable. It's the little things that count. Definitely like getting... Oh, I meant to eat. Oh, yeah. You guys have been telling me I need to be doing that. I agree. Uh, you can fast eat if you're unaware by holding the alt button. Oh, somebody got hit by a trap, it sounds like. All right. Chicken wing. 
Chicken wing, chicken wing. All right, you got an extra splint. Four pelt. I guess if we don't get much, we'll know it's there. Let me bust these with my busted axe. Uh, some milk. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Didn't that used to be two? Oh, traveling daggers. No bueno. Alright, so secret hole in the wall here. Oh, maybe we can trick him. It's only a problem if it's a gas one, then we gotta run. No, that's pretty good. Yeah, you exploded there, bro. Sorry. Oh, okay, we got a little bit of, uh... Got a little bit of uh, company coming here. Wow. Oh, I don't want... Yeah, I don't want that one. Everybody's like, where did he go? Who is this guy we're trying to... Is something going on? Alright, another one down. Let's do it. Come on, bro. Don't play with my emotions. Alright. Doggy. Why not? Aww. I don't like taking out good boys. He's just following orders. You sick. Sick people. Oh, I didn't even get a chance. <laughs> I was gonna throw the C's right back on him. I'm gonna turn it back on you. Alright. Nothing too crazy or spectacular so far. Alright, we got two openings here. Alright, that's probably where that one one of the guys came from was from this room. Okay, we got a second level. Oh, we got an archer. Decides he wants to wants to throw down. I don't know. You seem confused, bro. I'm here to fight. Dang. All right, we do need to sit for a second after that one. Yeah, ranged behavior was pretty weird there. I know on 17, they did change the number. It did seem like uh, they did a lot of rebalancing. I'm not sure how much of it affects us at this point, but probably a little bit at least. Okay, hunting bow is always worth it. All right, what's in here? Oh, man. They upgraded the exquisite casket. That looks pretty sick. It's definitely worth more than these busted daggers. And what about the 652 uh, for a bulge? I don't know that one. I haven't seen it yet. We'll keep the hunting bow for sure. Okay, definitely not bad. Uh, we got this guy looks like he's got a bulge. Wonder if he would if he move up. No. Nah, let's let's be safe. Since we're doing maces, you really do want to, like, keep consistency with doing this, uh, strategy of trying to get them in compromising positions. But, man. Whew. That guy busted my leg up. I should have tried to grab some leeches by the river or something. Alright. Definitely got a sits for this one. What was his weapon? Eldorian Long Axe. That sounds pretty sick. Is it worth anything? 546 isn't bad. Can try to teach us a little bit. No, I didn't want his. Sorry. Not want that. There we go. Bulge. Got everything. Everything we could ever want. Make sure we're we're sneaking and we're searching. 
We got, man, we got some big boys here, for sure. Definitely don't want to get caught with their pants down. Ooh. They got a stagger on us. Oh my gosh. Crude longsword is definitely big, big papa. All right, we're just hungry and thirsty. Hopefully we find the, uh, where they got, um, their water and stuff. Crude longsword will actually go for money too. So we'll probably do a trip back and forth. Considering we still have a whole other level to the dungeon that's unexplored. Is that? Oh, it's not active anymore. Yes, yeah, he's another big papa right there. This dungeon's definitely not playing. Haha. -ha. It's our problem with having to gear up for your strike like that. It, like, becomes an all or nothing. Yeah, leather vest. One coin, I shall take it. It is mine. Nah, we checked everybody there. Alright, there's probably... Oh, I was gonna say, there's probably another room, but there isn't. Alright, bolts of cloth. Yeah, we're gonna have to... Let's go do a trip there and back here. Ooh, another crowbar. Especially ours is on the ends here. Oh, we definitely want to eat these grapes. That's important. Alright. Let's break these. Oh, a pear. See, they got all the good eats here at the Bastion Dungeons. They'll take care of you. See, and then there's extra stuff here too. Maybe I could just throw my... I'll just throw my medical supplies down. I don't know that I really even needed to bring the antidote, but... Alright, and he's got his long flail. Uh... I guess we could ditch these right here. We won't get into any fights on the way there. Okay, so I'm gonna head back. And then... Oh, we do have a few other containers and stuff. Let's check those out real quick. Not that I have a ton of space left. No secret rooms this time. I'm spoiled now that we got that really good one last episode. Like, where's the other secret rooms? It'd be epic if we do find another one, though. It'd be like overkill. I'd be wishing for something like that on the, uh, on our next permadeath run. Oh, that's good. I'll just throw that out for right now. We can grab that. Another quilted coat. Interesting. This has been popping up with a certain amount of regularity. Alright. Spear. Yeah, okay. We'll come look. But yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Alright, guys. We are back. Let us get to level 2. Oh, we already got our first competitor. Who got him nice. Didn't even take very much uh, damage there. Spearman? Maybe? There we go. Come on, wait. How'd they get three hits on me? That ain't right. That 
That was pretty cheap. Although I think there is that buff that lets you do it like more than once, but still. Oh, we forgot to grab all our supplies. That would probably be helpful. Get all of our stuff back. There we go. Worry about the inventory management in a little bit here. Trying to carve out a little bit of uh, breathing room here in this area of the dungeon. Empty bowl. Dead end? Oh, big boy. I'm gonna run away from you. Um, this would probably be the best place. See the do the big axe and the big hammer guys. They don't they don't really scare me that much. That guy was kind of sneaky though. I don't like that. All right, this could be boss man. No, but not pleasant man's either. I'm surprised. I thought that that guy has like a dash move or something. Ooh, good thing I had him lined up. Nice. Hunter hatchet, long flail. Oh yeah, two-handed sword. That's probably just the crude long sword. Oh boy. Man, this is a big in. For sure. Oh, okay, somebody had heard me from there. I'm sure somebody looked at my is gonna look at my inventory and feel very OCD. All right, tough guy. Ooh, he's blocking me. There we go. You can't block me, man. We're so close to level ten. Ooh, a little bit more rep. Getting closer. I'm just sad no secret room so far. Alright, bust all this up because then we don't gotta come back over here. Alright, let's grab something to nosh on. Get some bread. Let's eat a whole loaf of bread. It's my favorite part of. Uh, about this game is just imagining you like doing stuff like that man I'm so hungry you just eat a single loaf of bread that's all you eat or you just eat a whole tomato just one bite because why not jeez this guy's got some good D he was ducking and dodging me there oh we're optimistic well that's good does it have to do with our Oh, okay, well, our morale and sanity are a little bit high. I mean, not ideal, but... Ooh, we got... I don't know if I want both of those guys to come for me at the same time. But it looks like we're just getting the one. He's got the axe. Ah. Oh. What you got? Is it worth anything? Militia bill. It's a little bit of cash. Alright. This guy. This guy's the sneaky guy. What you got, bruh? Yup. That's what I thought. Alright, we've got two ways here. Is that open or closed door? All right, that's a closed door. Let's go see this way. Ooh, I didn't mean to. That's not really the best positioning, but no, I think we'll be okay. I think I bought myself at least the stance. Yep, there we go. Ooh, 
Man, we got a pretty good uh, rotation of skills to use against these guys. They're hurting me, though. Let's take a quick sits. Alright. Alright, we did find the kitchen. There's no water, though. Got some tasty treats. Take the cheese. Nothing to cook. No onion, though. Problematic. I'll keep my optimism though. We were optimistic for a little bit there. I don't know what happened. Surprised no water barrel. These guys just don't get thirsty, I guess. Oh, another crowbar. What are they doing over here? I guess the, these guys are bandits, so. Oh, here we can merge that one. Make the other one disappear. It's like where all the dudes sleep or something. All right, this has got to be boss room. Yep, all right, who do we got? Okay, well, he sees me. We can draw him out at least. Uh, yeah, we just use our favorite spot right here. I mean, it's a pretty solid spot. Oh, he got confused. Because he's, like, dumb or something. All right, just enough space. He didn't even barely touch me. He had the Aldorian long axe. All right, take a quick sits. All right, boss man is gonna be in here. I'm curious, ooh, rogue knight, yikes. Okay, so this guy's not gonna be playing around. We're going to want to pop off the herbal extract. We might have to pop this off during battle. We'll see. Yeesh. I don't have any special kind of um, potions or anything with me either. So, all right. Just hopefully it's just the one guy. I don't want to draw in a second guy. Yeah, hey yourself there. We gotta at least draw him in best position for us. Ugh. Why they get so dumb? Okay, come on, bro. Oops, sorry, guys. I don't want to pick that up, but I want to move. No! Oh my gosh, this is nightmare. Okay, best I can do. Ugh, fumbled it. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was the worst. If I didn't have to get set up, I could have had my stance going. Oh. Oh, seriously? Okay, so the one thing that I did grab... I do have the drunkenness potion. I wanted to try to throw at him to see if that does does what I think it will. Alright, we'll still go for the same spot. Don't wanna Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Oh my gosh, I'm barely doing anything to him. Still no. <laughs> oh, we missed it. Oh my gosh, this is not good. <laughs> uh, let's do that. Maybe we'll win being all tripped out. Probably not. Oh, I was hoping we get lucky. All right. Maybe we're not to where we can fight this guy. Oh my gosh. Okay. I don't think I can throw this. Oh, I can throw it at him. Okay. Let's stance up. Okay. Then let's try it. 
<gasps> I got him. <laughs> oh man, he got us with the. He got a bleed on us though. Okay, so drink and protect me. All right. All right, did we get any? We okay, we got a little bit of them. Nope. Oh, <laughs> we're 60%. Uh, the drunkenness might not actually be helping. His pain limit does go up. All right, we can only pray that something. Let's let's do something random. We'll probably get killed. No. Uh, we could just hit him, but I just don't have, let's see. Okay. So that was going to happen. All right. Let's try it again. All right, guys, we are back to try him one more time. At least I felt like it was pretty close. We got him to like 60%. I don't know that throwing the drunk potion was a good idea. See, I think, yeah, he's still following me. Okay, so we're still going to take the same position. We've got, uh, because we get the henbane. So I think instead of popping off elusiveness right away, which is pretty dumb, we'll use henbane to start with. Because he's going to charge up before he starts attacking. He's going to do ray shield and all his stuff, so. Uh, and then pain we'll use this the only problem is with the intoxication I probably should have gotten an antitoxin, but then you start getting into using a lot of turns to balance it out So you really don't want to go down that route uh, We do have this option too But uh Let's wait we'll do one turn I'll stance cuz it oh, I thought he could rush maybe Now nah, we missed him with that anyways so, oh, we should have taken. All right. So I took out a good chunk of his armor, at least. Again, 65%. So we'll pop off because he's going to attack us now. Ooh. All right. Still not good. Uh, we do have heroism going. We have extra dodge. The pain isn't really good or ideal. Yeah, this probably isn't going to get much further than this. I was hoping we would get uh, get something. But no, I think we'll just go another attack. Yeah, that's it. All right. <laughs> I know I said we're all done. I literally cleared the rest of the dungeon. And then I went and saved, and then now I'm back here. So, let's get all stuff so we can see where we're at. Okay, so the plan is, he's rolling up. I'll throw my stance, then I'll throw Henbane, then I'll start just wailing on him. And then after that, um, we'll have elusiveness and drunkenness, just if we want as backups. But, because we got his durability down kind of quick. So I wanted to see more of that, but it just didn't happen. It was also raining, so I got the rain debuff, but I don't know that it's going to hurt us. Okay, so he can dash, and since I got rid of that crate, he probably can run up on us. So I'll wait till I can see him. Okay, we did have that. Ah, oh, we didn't get the battle rage. You just got thirsty. Okay, so that was a solid hit before he got his first buff in. We missed our C's. Got that going. All right, his armor is low. Let's see. He can luck out with this. All right, he did give us a bleed. It didn't do much more. We're going to need... This sucks, but let's pop off. 
Because that should... I thought elusiveness gives you 100% on the first one. Alright, well, I don't have much other choice. Dang, that didn't even help at all. Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, round like seven here. I don't know, you guys are probably can keep better count than me. I'm gonna still keep the same pattern and hopefully Henbane triggers this time. Because it didn't before. And that like wasn't really cool, you know? No! Oh my gosh, okay. That might have boned me. Let's see. Because I wanted to drink something too. I don't know why I just ran straight into here. Because I'm going to be boned on hunger and thirst already. Oh boy. Alright. Let's. I guess we can at least try. We've got that. Thirst is going to come right here when we use this. Hopefully we get battle rage. Uh, oh no. We need this. Oh, that is pure luck. All right, let's try. So we at least got C's on him. He did get a bleed on us. And he's not, he's still not, it's not like the best situation here. He has defensive stance. He hasn't used Ray's shield yet. So let me, Flurry of Blows him. He ducked me and he messed me up my leg. See, it's just it just seems impossible because he still has against the odds too. Let's see if that can help at all. Cause my leg is broken, so. Uh this is probably it right here. Alright, this is our final attempt. I took it a little more careful. I cleared out this stuff. I made sure I'm fed and watered. So we... See, I thought that the elusiveness potion at least used to do like 100% dodge for the first turn. But maybe they nerfed it. Okay. So at least we should have... So we've got one, two, three, right? We want... So... Let's... We're not that thirsty. Let's... Actually, let's pop off Handbane. Because it didn't freaking work. So we'll drink. And then we'll pop off... I was hoping for that, that battle rage might help put us over the edge here. Nah, he got his his shields and stuff up, and he's already bled me. That's the problem, too, right? Is if he does that bleed, you're pretty boned. Can just hope that he misses us. He dodged all... I mean, he blocked all four. His block power's gotta be crazy. Alright, so all he's got... He's got Breakthrough. Which is not fun. That he could use that. Jeez. Alright, this is probably it. Let's see, 50%. That's probably about the best that we can do. Yeah, I might have had um, another mace hit. I really... I'm, I'm done with the boss. It's not possible. It's not really that close. And I know people will probably come in and go, Beardo, you need way better gear. I have to ask the devs why that would be available and there'd be like no gear. Because if I go down here, it's like two helmets and then like one of each type of weapon. And I get it. You probably need to do more reputation gain, but I can't beat the quest. So how am I going to get more reputation? Seems like a weird balance thing. See, most of the stuff I sold and I don't even need. There's no kind of boots or anything. So... My own grievance, it's just kind of a pain to have to continually do that fight, but uh, the one thing that I had changed, I don't know if you guys had noticed, I got the doublet just because it was giving additional dodge chance, which seemed to help, but it wasn't nearly enough because these aren't these weapons were not penetrating his armor. So I would need like an next tier weapons, I think, to even scratch him, but 
All right, well, I already sent you guys off one, so I'll see you on the next one. Peace.